Okay, today we are going to tell you a little bit about the project that we are working on, which is called the Discomfort Zone. Who would like to start to tell us something about this? Just start. Are you discomfortable? <laughs> I'm, I'm not personally uncomfortable, yeah. but my students are uncomfortable. So as, as a teacher in enabling education, when my students arrive here on campus, they are frequently overwhelmed out of their comfort zone, out of their depth. They don't know anyone who's gone to university, they don't know what to expect. And so we go to a lot of trouble to try and help them feel like they belong. We explicitly give them, ex uh, give them information, sorry. Um, but that means that the onus is on us to make them feel comfortable. And there are plenty of times when people um, are in a new environment and they don't have somebody to help and them. And the question is, who is responsible there? Is it the institution? that needs to make them feel comfortable, like first year experience or something, or is it the individual that needs to take responsibility for their own integration? And how can we help them well, in this I think context? the institution, anywhere you go, does a lot of that stuff for you. And, and part of you know being an adult and going to uni is um, yeah taking responsibility on your own. And speaking from my own experience as an international student, I um, you, you are, out of your comfort zone a little bit and it's yes. even with little things like going and opening up a bank account or, or getting a mobile phone or just going grocery shopping mm. um, so these are all little areas of discomfort that you sort of have to get comfortable with I think mm. going abroad is mm. one of the big discomfort yeah. zones yeah. Uh, in our project we call it these islands there are several mm. ones yeah. one would be going abroad one would be your first week yeah. at the university yeah. 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 public speaking my my students all oh, say that they are really sure. worried so so the idea is visiting these different islands, of spending discomfort. some time there of discomfort, yeah, yeah, yeah. islands of discomfort. Yeah, yeah, and language is a, is a big barrier. Yeah. yeah. Mm. So if Most English definitely. is not your first language and or another language is not your first language, you go to that country and you're shy, mm. you're intimidated, you have great angst of doing the wrong thing and mm. saying the wrong mm. thing and people start laughing about you. Mm. So how can we help people? How can we break it down? Uh, there's talk about a game, so yeah, what, what yeah. can we do there? Yes, a game could be a good idea. It's a, it's a safe haven, it's a test bed. You can make as many errors and mistakes mm. as you like. And right. then that is true. Yeah. In yeah. real life, yes. yeah. <laughs> when one, you, chance. one chance. Yeah, often you only have one <laughs> chance. When you go abroad, for example, if you mess it up and you yeah. don't make any friends within the first two weeks, yes. yeah. then you often find that these people already have friends and yeah. it's much more difficult. So you're right. In a game, you... You've got to make the most of being uncomfortable. Yeah, that's <laughs> yes. right. Yes. And, and if, yeah. it, if you die in the game... Yeah doesn't matter, here's another yes. life try again. Exactly. So it's a really and safe space. For I like this idea of friends. making the most of being uncomfortable mm. and, and actually making it a continuous mm. experience. That's right. Not, not mm. like a camping holiday for no. like for two weeks, you, you have a toilet outside or something yeah. and then afterwards you go back to your normal oh, home. <laughs> oh, it's over. No, yeah. it shouldn't be like that. No, it should be you're coming home and you think, oh, this is boring. What's I have two next? bathrooms. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so <laughs> what is next? What is the next level? And That's what right. is the island I want to visit? Almost almost like a journey sure. somehow from yeah. one discomfort to the next. Yeah, it's a, it's a discomfort simulation. <laughs> so to speak. Great way to put it. Yeah. Great way to put it. Mm. So, until you get addicted to it. And when you when you come to a comfort zone you think, okay, uh, I, I only have the water up to here, that means I must be in the children's swimming pool. Let's get out of there. Yeah. Or, or you go to the next level. Yeah. And then you jump into the real experience and you go abroad. Yeah. Mm. And I think the game could actually help you to grade it a little bit and to mm -hmm. find out what am I really worried about. Yes. Yep. Yeah. And, and then but choose, self -reflection. Yeah. choose yeah. the next best discomfort island to yeah. go to as well. Mm. Yeah. Well, if you're interested in that, please get in touch with the project team. Mm -hmm. We would love to give you some insights into what we've been doing. Thank you very much.